five must watch Japanese variety TV shows on Netflix. Netflix has shown a stronger interest in foreign shows year after year, including reality TV. While the rules is short, a total of eight, not including seasons, Japanese reality TV shows have proven to be hot with online audiences. Most recently, one about toddlers in their first era has taken the lead at appealing to a mass audience. Unlike reality shows here in the US, Japanese reality shows offer a more wholesome experience, but there is typically little drama between cast members. Are you ready to take the plunge into Japanese reality TV? Here are the shows on Netflix you need to add to your, li to your list. Old enough? Hajime no Old enough, Hajime no Osaka on my little first era in Japanese has steered a lot of online conversation. From rave reviews to concerned parents, notably those in the US, the 30 year old show's premise is simple. Parents send their children, aged two, ages 2 to 5, on their first errand by themselves. What comes to next is absolutely adorable and inspiring. Most of the children succeed in their errands. Whether it's buying fish for the market or picking up diapers for their younger siblings, each child does their best to impress their child parents. This is a very Japanese show and a normal event in Japanese society. If there was one word to sum up old enough, it would be wholesome. There are currently 20 bingable episodes on Netflix. The Future Diary Welcome to The Future Diary. Nope, not the anime. If you love love at first sight type of shows with a smattering of romantic drama, this show comes highly recommended. The show sets out to see see if two strangers can fall in love in the span of a month by following the diaries that they are given. Andrews range for initiating hand-holding on the third date the resisting telling the other person your true feelings until the very end. Out of all the show on the, this list, the future diary is the most staged due to the pre-written diary the participants need to follow the progress of their own love story. There are a lot of ups and downs that warm the heart and their quirky pull out of its hard strings, making this show irresistible. Two seasons with new episodes launching weekly are currently, currently on the streaming service. Love is Blind Japan Yes, Love is Blind is a Japanese version. The show are essentially the same. Can people really fall in love before seeing, before seeing the other person? Love is Blind Japan tests the theory that gives us a dose of Japanese dating culture. It's a lot of fun to see which couples hit it off before meeting and after and do so well. Don't. There are 11 episodes in Indulge In. Terry's House Terry's House has been a hot show since its beginning, rather than having a goal to couple up. Terry's House simply lets the cast leave, as it will during their daily lives just with six strangers to mingle with. Spoiler, some do date with other fizzle out, or some hokos and their couriers are living in the house. Four seasons are out on Netflix. Falling in Love Like a Romantic Drama Falling in Love Like a Romantic Drama is exactly how it sounds. A professional models, actors, and musicians keep their composure and or end up falling for their partner. In the scenes, they must act out. The actors must perform a scene from a romantic drama with the end leading to a kiss. They must beat out their other competing couples while seeing if sparks will fly. You can watch all three seasons on Netflix. Honorable Mansion I Nori Love Wagon I Nori Love Wagon feels like a fever dream with its many adventures and zany activities. The only way to lead the giant pink bus is to confess to another person who reciprocates the feeling and leave together to start their relationship back home. Two seasons currently live on Netflix. Please share your favorite Japanese reality TV shows with us so we can indulge in them too.